Good day everyone! In this follow-up video we'll continue on our way from Tadum to Baolok, nestled in Vietnam Central Highlands. Good. Yeah, very local, very simple, but I like it. Shower. Okay, cool. I just don't know what to expect because I haven't been on this road in my life. You see this? This car overtaking me in a curve like this. The area is a coffee producing region in Vietnam and we are currently on road 28 or QL28. Soon we're going to make a right on provincial road 725 or DT725. Besides showing you the wonderful route from Tadung to Baolok, I'll give you some tips on how to book good cheap accommodation on a trip like this in Vietnam. And you have to see this. Wow, look at that. Wow, man. Wow, man. Look how half blue, half green it is. I have been traveling in Vietnam for almost 17 years, and trust me, homestays offer the most authentic experience. You meet the nicest people and you enjoy the best food. I love smoke in the countryside. It smells so good unless it's rubber, tires, plastic. But this is... Ah, bliss. You'll usually find them as close as you can get to the nature. How to book cheap, good accommodation? Forget about all those booking apps. Why? Oh, 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 nice curve! Just lean into it! Because firstly, many homestays are not even on those apps. The host may not know how to register or may not even care to register. Vietnam Rider! Ha ha ha! Mr. Talking Crazy went on caffeine! Woo ha! Secondly, if some homestays are on those apps, the host will pay a commission which can be around 20% of the price you pay for the night which means they will only cash in about 80% we should all support local people and small local businesses shouldn't we? and finally it's simply easier to go on google maps turn on your location and check out something in your proximity instead of navigating on two apps simultaneously man this is getting better I'll guide you in three easy steps. Just go on Google Maps and one, type in Homestay. Then zoom into Baolok and tap Search this area. Two, check the location, photos and reviews. Okay guys, so uh... This is a junction I was telling you about. So now we have about 35 kilometers left to Baolo. At this junction, you have to turn right on DT or Provincial Road, DT725. The sign is right there. Anyway, it's a biggish road on the map, so you can't miss it. And three, get their phone number and add them on Zalo. You should download this local Vietnamese app and contact them to book a room and perhaps ask them for more photos or videos of the room you want to book. After those 20k on uh, DT 725, you're gonna get to this intersection. You're coming from there. You're gonna go straight to that one. All right, now let's get going. Camera on. Fifteen kilometers left to my homestay, and this road looks interesting. It's under construction. From 
pam pam uh-huh okay where are we we follow little and cat road left again and the right on funding fung good and that's 408 funding fung that's good no need for the map anymore all right let's go further it's never a good idea to turn in a, in a junction like that again at the end of this street when there should be a dead end right there should be a dead end all right all right where's the dead end dead end come i would like to dedicate this video of random nonsense to my good mate graham uh, please do tell me what i should you know do better what i should change what i should anything if you have questions ask me i'd love to answer you if you have advice, if you have ideas, just uh, tell me in your comments. Uh, okay, the dead end is here. Funding Foon, yes, it is. I saw it. It's the right one. Good. 436, okay. Just about 400 numbers. Give me a number. 200, okay. Halfway there. I hope I can park right next to my bungalow. <laughs> it is 354, let's see. Oh, 338. Oh, 8. 368. All right, 50 numbers more. That's 25 houses. Aha. Funding homestay looks good. Why didn't I put this one? <laughs> That's what I would do. I stopped booking accommodation on some third party platforms unless in some special situations. Simply because I don't like how much money they take from the host through those commissions. Let's all support sustainable tourism. Some homestays are located within or near tea plantations, offering a unique experience. Go ahead, hey, come. Anh chị ơi. Let's call them. Come on, man. Okay. Okay. Ah, chào chị. Em đặt phòng uh, qua Zalo. Chị biết đúng không? Phòng uh, qua một bạn nam nói chuyện qua yeah. điện thoại. Dạ, dạ, dạ. Vâng. Thì cái phòng này này phòng như kiểu này giá đây và phòng như này à, dạ, dạ. Okay. có thể đi bằng xe xe dạ. để tại đó rồi không dạ, khu trên kia đấy có cái ăn đứng dạ. à ok ok dạ. cảm ơn consider homestays in areas like the outskirts of Baolong or near natural attractions such as waterfalls and scenic viewpoints in the photos it looks amazing let's see how it looks in reality because everybody filters photos and videos these days except uh, myself I don't like that. Ciao anh. Em đang quay em muốn kiểu chia sẻ kinh nghiệm. Watch me every Friday at 8 p.m. Vietnam time. Thank you and goodbye. Yeah, very local, very simple, but I like it. Very old style wood. Nice shower. Okay, cool. Look at the view. Oh, we have some water here. <laughs> nice. Okay, goodbye guys. Scusi, asta a fost un adevărat succes. Am făcut la filmări, am făcut și eu azi primul meu timelapse pe valea aia cu lacul ăla, cu barajul și cu insulițele. Chiar că e ceva frumos. A fost și curcubeu. Parcă desenează cineva un cer pe cer. Deci că e fals atât de tare. Și după aia se duce și se mișcă norii. Super mal făcut timelapse-ul.